Hello, hello, you beautiful souls. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Michelle. We talk all things life, love, spirituality, law of attraction, and all of that juicy goodness. In this manifestation video, we are going to talk more about the law of attraction and how whatever you are putting out there is what you are receiving. So right now, if you were to pause and take a deep breath and look at what is around you, what does your bank account look like? How are all of your relationships? What is your work life like? Is every aspect of your life in order and feeling good? If they're not, make a little list of what you'd like to see improvement on, okay? And now you want to put yourself, your energy, your feelings, your emotions, your thoughts into the vibration of the person that has everything clicked into place. So let's give an example. If you are trying to manifest more money, you have to start waking up each day as if you have the money in the account, the amount that you'd wish to have. You are spending money with this free sensation of I have it and I want to be giving. And the minute I hand the money to the person or I use my card or whatever it is, it is a good, excited feeling because you have it. If you're not in that vibration when you're spending or giving or receiving money, you are sending a signal to the universe that you don't have enough or you don't have what you desire. So the universe is only going to keep giving you that. So the first step to using the law of attraction to your benefit, in reality, you're actually using it every single minute. It's just, what are you creating more of? Now you can take the reins and be like, okay, I know that I'm manifesting every single second of every single day. We are manifesting all the time, but now we can be intentional with it and say, okay, if I want this to happen in the next hour, if I want this in my bank account tomorrow, if I want to have this relationship with this person, I am going to, in this now moment, be the person that has the thing. And it takes you stepping into the feelings, the thoughts, the emotions, the, the energy, of that person. So you might have to sit down and spend five minutes really thinking about what it would feel like to have that thing. And I know that I struggled with this. I had never really made anything, anything more than like $2,000 in a paycheck before I taught for 17 years. And then I had this wonderful opportunity. As soon as I hopped on the manifestation board, and I started playing the game, I got this great opportunity. The universe brought me an opportunity to make an, a virtual program. Well, the very first check that I received for this, from this program was it amounted to about $29,000. Um, I think 700, it was 29,750, which was huge. <laughs> I had never seen more than $2,000 in a paycheck. So for me to get this, direct deposit in my account. I'm like, did I just like literally earn like $30,000? And the beauty of it was I wrote, I am so grateful now that I have $30,000 six months prior. So I manifested the 30,000 doing what I love, being of service, helping kids. And the feeling, I can't even tell you guys, the feeling in my body that I felt seeing that money in the account, knowing that I quickly, like I paid for a vacation as, as quickly as I could. I bought, I didn't buy, I rented these two little cottages up in Cape Cod, one for me and one for my sister's family. I got a great deal because my friend owned them, but I quickly reserved them. I'm like, I am celebrating this. And the feeling that I felt in my body to say, I have it. I have it. I can do this. I can take you here. I can do this for myself. I can pay off this. I can put this away for myself. So it will grow. That money <laughs> gave me, it was my first glimmer of what it felt like to not be in lack. And sometimes, I mean, look at my life prior to that. I never really felt that. So I couldn't really blame myself for not understanding, watching a video like this that says, put yourself in the vibration of it. <laughs> you can't do it if you've never felt it. So my goal is to maybe help you look at somewhere else in your life where you just felt like this immense joy about something. You receive something and you're just like, I didn't think I was going to get this. Oh my gosh. Or you have some sort of success in your life, in your past, go to that feeling. Even if it's when you were a kid and maybe you got a brand new bike or you got a job or you just passed this test, whatever it is, 
put yourself in the vibration of that feeling. Okay. And now sit with that for about four to five minutes and just, I'll never forget the feeling. I have it. Like I have it and I earned it and I, I changed the world with it. And if you can go to that imaginary space and do it for your future, the more you do that, the more your manifestation moves closer to you because now you're being the person that has the thing. And if you can imagine my version of Michelle, who had only ever gotten a $2,000 paycheck, she had no idea what that felt like. So she was living in the body of lack. She was always thinking, I don't have enough. This is not going to happen to me. I don't even know what, you know, $30,000 feels like. And now here's Michelle, who does know what that feeling is like. And she received that money being of service, being a good person, not really wanting it just for greed reasons, but she wanted to use that money to now, you know, celebrate her family or use it to do good. I know that vibration over here now. So now when I'm manifesting in the future, I step into that version of myself. And maybe you all can use this example and use that $30,000 version of Michelle. You step into that version of her. Put yourself in the energy of you're at the store and you're talking to your kids and you're like, yeah, babe, you can get that. We have the money. We can do that. The universe pays our bills. We'll get it back. You know, we can spend money on the roof to fix it. We have it. And you're just always saying we have it. We're good. No worries. That's when you're really in the groove and you're in that vibration. So forgive yourself if you've been struggling in the past to be in that newer version of yourself because it's hard. If we've never experienced these manifestations, it can be really difficult to understand how to get into that vibration of the person that has it, but it is possible. You just have to think of a time that you felt joy and go there as much as you can in your head. And I do this like maybe 10 times a day. Anytime there's a lull, I get off the phone with somebody, I quickly cleanse my energy or if I'm out for a walk, I am always going back to, all right, Michelle, what do you want to create right now? Oh, universe, it feels so good that I made $500 today. Thank you so much for bringing me $500 and I didn't even have to do anything. Oh my gosh, I can see my Venmo lighting up on my phone. This is so crazy. And I'll do that for about 30 seconds and that's it. And I'm putting myself in the vibration of the Michelle that has it. Okay, so I hope this video helped you. If you can start to really use the law of attraction and be intentional and any lull in your day, any like, quiet moment, ask yourself, what do I want to create right now? You can think any thought and you can have it come true. If you want to manifest a large amount of money, if you want to manifest your dream home, put yourself in the vibration of the person that has it. I posted a quick little short this morning of me driving past my dream house. I drive by it every day and I always say, universe, please bring me that house or something better. It's got a beautiful yard and you can see the lines and the grass so cut so perfectly. It's private. There's no neighbors. It's got like a little pond in the back to go fishing. There's a, a wraparound deck. It's just beautiful. And I just imagine myself pulling in the driveway every day. And I imagine sitting on the deck with my coffee and the kids playing in the yard and me thinking about what project I'm going to do that day or where I'm going to film, um, what cute space in the house I'm going to film in because I'm going to have all these different spots. Uh, I just have this visual and I put myself in the vibration of the person that lives in the home. And I know it's going to come true for me. So do that for you too. All right, lovies, be the person that has the thing. All right, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. And I cannot wait to see you all in the next video. Thank you so much for being here. Sending you so much love.